Goodbye. Goodbye. Okay. Mm hmm. Ah. Uh, leave it. Ah. Uh, leave it. Ah. Uh, Ah. Ah. Good boy. Stay. Oops. Ah. Good boy. Stay. Good boy, Toya. Good boy. Good boy. Okay, get it. You trying to bury your bone in the couch? <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing, Bowser?
it's about 2.30, almost 3 o'clock in the morning. I came down to see these two puppies. They were barking. And I found one of them, a little polar bear here, running around free. Now, assuming he does it for me again, we will witness him escaping his whelping box. And come on, polar bear. Do it for the camera. Come on, polar bear. Great, now that I'm here, they're happy. Oh, here we go. Um, come on, polar bear. Do it for the camera. You're teasing me, aren't you? Both of you. I'm going to step back. I'm just going to walk. I watched him do this three times already. And now he's not going to do it now that I have the camera out. Come on, polar bear. Come on, boy. Come on. Escape. Oh, yeah. I'm definitely going to be chopping this video up. That's the first born. Right, there's the polar bear. Come on, pups, I know you can escape. Oh, oh, could this be it? Be it. And there he goes. The polar bear has escaped his whelping box in the middle of the night. And due to this little phenomenon, they all start barking, starting with the mother, then the brother, then him. And this is why I am up at 3 in the morning. Alright. Are you going to do it? Oh. And he's out again. Polar bear has escaped once more. <laughs> Hi, Bar Hi, Aunt Barbara. Middle of the night. They're keeping me up. The mom's keeping me up. All because the polar bear here has figured out how to escape his pen. And his brother doesn't like it and his mother doesn't like it. And now that I'm here, he's calmed down. Right here's your puppy. Middle of the night. 100% awake because he naps all day. And right there in the solid blue collar is his brother. We only have two puppies left. Yeah. His, their sister went to my cousin Bridget or her boyfriend. Their other sister lives about. <laughs> there they go. Lives about uh, 
20 minutes away from me. And the brother that was here before with the black tail, one we called Shu, he now lives in Columbus with a, with a very nice family, which just leaves Polar Bear and his brother here. These two have been getting, getting along just fine. They play, they sleep. It's just one. One of them, namely him, manages to escape the pen. The other one gets upset. And when the other one gets upset, Mommy, over here, gets angry at me and makes me come down here just to do this, just to sit with them, and then they quiet down, I put them back in, and he manages to escape again, and the whole cycle starts over. So, here's me trying to get a good night's sleep yet again.
Yeah. <laughs> 